Baruch Shani to Baruch 44. And I, Baruch, went from thence and came to my people. And I called my firstborn son and the Gelel Yahus, my friends, and seven of the elders of the people. And I said unto them, Behold, I go unto my fathers according to the way of all the earth, but withdraw ye not from the way of the Torah, but guard and admonish the people which remain, lest they withdraw from the commandments of El Elohim. For ye see that he whom we serve is just, and our Creator is no respecter of persons. And see ye what has befallen Sion, and what has happened to Yerushalayim. For the judgment of El Elohim shall thereby be made known, and his ways, which, though past finding out, are right. For if ye endure and persevere in his fear, and do not forget his Torah, the times shall change over you for good, and ye shall see the consolation of Sion. Because whatsoever is now is nothing, but that which shall be is very great. For everything that is corruptible shall pass away, and everything that dies shall depart, and all the present time shall be forgotten nor shall there be any remembrance of the present time, which is defiled with evils. For that which runs now runs unto vanity, and that which prospers shall quickly fall and be humiliated. For that which is to be shall be the object of desire, and for that which comes afterwards shall we hope. For it is a time that passes not away, and the hour comes which abides forever, and the new world comes which does not turn to corruption, those who depart to its blessedness, and has no mercy on those who depart to torment, and leads not to perdition those who live in it. For these are they who shall inherit that time, which has been spoken of, and theirs is the inheritance of the promised time. These are they who have acquired for themselves treasures of wisdom, and with them are found stores of understanding, and from mercy have they not withdrawn, and the truth of the Torah have they preserved. For unto them shall be given the world to come, but the dwelling of the rest, who are many, shall be in the fire.